This is a first for 10 years younger because no one has ever had two doses of surgery. Yeah. And today is? Is the... Bingo arms. Yeah. So rid of those. <laughs> um, the thighs. And it's going to lift my belly button up as well. Julian, is there anything you don't like or approve of so far? I mean, so far, I mean, the results are great. Really? You know, she looks stunning. I, I mean, the boobies are great. It's great to have her two new friends back, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Jilly's never been one to let a good deed go unrewarded. Look what she's given me for my efforts. A pair of cufflings. They're rather nice, aren't they? Special for my breast clinic. First on Jan's to-do list is Jilly's tummy button. The body lift left it stranded far from home. Mabel's looking good, so Jan moves on to the thigh lift. To hide the scar, the incision's made just on the line where knicker elastic makes its mark anyway. I think we've taken out um, probably five or six centimetres from the widest part. Quite a bit. Um, two and a half inches, maybe. Two hours in, Jan's ready for the upper arms. Bingo wings are a woman. Men tend to have thicker skin, which ages more slowly and retains its elasticity longer than female flesh. But hoisting the sag can, in some cases, leave a nasty armpit to elbow scar, a risk Jilly thinks is worth taking. They are perfect. Any sort of surgery leaves you feeling rocky. Jilly's had three operations in two years, two of them in the past six and a half weeks. Full recovery takes antibiotics and time. This last lot of surgery has been hard. I just generally feel unwell. I think it's just caught with me. The amount of surgeries I've had in the last few weeks has just caught with me all of a sudden. I can deal with pain and I can deal with discomfort. I cannot deal with feeling sick. 